journey to the summit of European football starts with the opening fixture of the Champions League. So it's away we go then. So Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Um, Claudio Marchisio, I think, is one to, to single out. He has all the tools for a, a complete midfielder, but his greatest appetite is for the opposition's penalty box. And if there's any doubt, he'll just bust the gut to get forward. And he's always willing to take a risk. He would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. Now it's Mandzukic. Mandzukic is alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Daniel Alves tries a through ball and he's onside Mohamed Salah Mohamed Salah and they've got it back as soon as they gave it away if you have just joined us well you've missed no goals Mohamed Salah does not like coming off second best has got good distance on that now it's Morata dashing forward at pace and Mandzukic to be fair that was tough for the keeper to handle balls out on the left now Dodo it's a good run down the left hand side Cristiano Ronaldo! Interference and very necessary. Keeps everyone guessing. It's well blocked and back out it comes. Mohamed Salah. It's in! Look, there are always tactical adjustments for any coach to make at half-time, but when your star man gives you a critical lead just before the break, everyone will be paying extra attention. It really is the ideal tonic. Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Listen, it's no surprise to me as to who scored the goal. When you look through this team, he's the standout performer with a, a whole repertoire of different talents. He'll do for me every time. If you get that clear. And it's half-time here. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to... Here we go again then. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. De Bruyne. Dodo. And it's De Bruyne. De Bruyne looking for options. Looks like a good ball through. There's still just the goal between them. And he's pulled him up for that challenge. Mandzukic. And he's through on goal. A wonderful effort all by himself. Ah, such a pity. He did the hard part by getting into position to shoot, but just couldn't find a good enough effort in the end. Salah, lovely bit of skill. Mohamed Salah, can he find a finish now? And in it goes. Two to the good. They have breathing space. A 
Buffon maybe was unsighted by his own defence there. Just look at the way the ball sneaked through that defensive line, and I don't think he could pick it up until it was way too late. That second goal is such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. And it's Salah. Salah plays it in. Plays it out of harm's way. Not the worst cross in the world, but still room for improvement. Quadrado tries the route one option. Modric. it through it's Salah they are rampant surely now beyond all doubt uh, given such an open invitation he was always going to shoot it's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats they knew and yet they didn't heed and they paid the price and deserved it he snaffles his third, and that earns him the match ball. Well, he's been the outstanding player on the pitch, and devastating in front of the goal. What a display, what a player. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Pops it towards the front. Now the pass. Pogba. A chance! It's there! They are running riots here! What a clean hit. No one gets in the way of that. Is it just me or did he make that look very, very easy? That was terrific skill and composure from him. He finished with such a plumb. Comes it forwards. Fine defending there. Dodo. ball oh, that's not going to find its target and that is the last effort of the game pretty much the ideal start a win on the first day Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury, and this is Jim Beglin. Thanks, Peter. Hello, everybody. I'm ready to see what unfolds in this one now. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Um, I, I would think the Argentinian Ezequiel Levetti. His low centre of gravity... Makes a very... That a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. <laughs> Lovetsi. Lovetsi! And he's there to make a great save. I thought he was magnificent then. He had no right to get anywhere near that. What a save. Lavezzi. It's Lavezzi! And again, the keeper stands strong. Oh, that's a stunning save. I mean, his reflexes were incredible then. That's as good a save as you'll see. And that's a goal kick. Well, and it's Ibrahimovic. Where to from here? David Luiz gets into the right position to intercept. De Bruyne. 
Neither side yet able to find the net. Mohamed Salah! There it is! Oh, the cross was inch perfect and the header unerring. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Listen, it's no surprise to me as to who scored the goal. When you look through this team, he's the standout performer with a, a whole repertoire. It's in! A simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Ibrahimovic. Now the pass. Lucas Moura. Ibrahimovic. It's Lavezzi! Got just about enough on that, but all at the expense of a corner. Turns and goes back. Oh, tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. You have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing. But instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here. It's corner. Played it short. Plenty waiting in the middle. De Ville plotting from out on the right hand side. And that's a throw. Aimed forward. The three's had a look and he's blown his whistle for half time. So once again, we're underway. Matuidi. Lucas Moura. Moves out on the left now. Tries a through ball. Tries the cut back. It's well blocked and back out it comes. Passes it through. Mohamed Salah. Wanders offside. He's just drifted beyond the last defender. Thiago Silva David Luiz Marco Verratti Good spell of possession this but very little to show for it Now it's Verratti Rabiot It's a brilliant interception Big chance that's offside. Yes, it is. Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, my word, my word, that is fantastic! A finish of true class! And they get themselves in front! Contact was crisp and clean. That was just a rocket. Is it just me or did he make that look very, very easy? That was terrific skill and composure from him. He finished with such a plumb. Oh, look, it's lovely having a player with such ability in your side. He's always capable of coming up with something important. And he's done it again. Matuidi. Marco Verratti Matuidi and it's Ibrahimovic Rabiot 
Now it's Ibrahimovic. Looks like a good ball through. It's Lavezzi! Oh, that could cost them. Well, he was so eager to score there, he almost put too much into that attempt to equalise. What a waste. Rabio! Tony Kroos gets it away. Mohamed Salah. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Looks to slip it through. Maxwell. De Bruyne with the ball through. Oh, surely that deserved better. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. That's a poor kick by the keeper. He's just given it straight back. Looks like a good ball through. Tries a through ball. And to Bruyne! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Information that there will be four minutes stoppage time. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. Lavezzi decides to play it back. Rabio! And the referee brings it to a close. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. So a warm welcome to you all, we will be on the way very shortly, once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm Peter Drury, and here with me in the commentary box, I'm glad to report, is Jim Beglin. Hi everyone, and thanks Peter, it's great to be on board. So Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Julio Cesar's the man, just keep an eye out for his kicking and general distribution, it's seriously good. He can get his team on the front foot very quickly through that accurate passing. Yes, they'll certainly be leaning heavily on him. He played it short. Can he score? It's a loose ball. Superb goal! And what a great way to start the game to spark the game I mean the captain has basically triggered a contest that should be even livelier than we anticipated get your seat belts on this could be rather exciting Julio Cesar reacted well to the initial effort but couldn't get it right out of the danger area oh Peter you can't teach that you either have it or you don't his anticipation is on another level to everyone else's superb Benfica trail at this early stage. How will they respond? Tony Kroos. And scored inside the first ten minutes to give them a 1-0 lead. Silvio Gaitan Cristiano Ronaldo looks to slip it through Luis Sao boots it to safety and they've seen lots of the ball time to go for it a bit a bit of creativity and adventure goes wide Gaitan Silvio Mitroglu tries a through ball now here's the through ball timely intervention 
It's a long pass towards the front. Gaitan plays it out to the wing. Silvio looking to get on the end of this. Can he deliver? And it's Gaitan. Benfica desperately needs someone to hold up the ball here. Looks to thread it through. Mitroglou. Gaitan. And Gaitan! This could fall anywhere. And the whistle goes for half-time. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to groom with the lead at half-time. And that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep it. Leading 1-0 at the break. So, off we go once more. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Salvia. For a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. And the volley. Loose. So still just the goal between them. Now it's Mitroglou. Now it's Mohamed Salah. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Silvio gives chase. Another chance from a corner. been taken short gets it into the middle up for a header well he would surely have scored there more times than not Salvia now it's Gaitan passes it through He's off on a marauding run. Cristiano Ronaldo. Pumps it upfield. Gaitan. Luisao. And it's Salvio. So what now? Thrust towards the front line. And he's there to cut it out. Mitsoglu! Oh, should have been the equaliser. I think he rushed that. He had a bit more time than he realised. He could so easily have equalised there. So that's it, it is all over. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Well, once they got that goal, I just thought they were very dogged in seeing the game through. Yeah. The warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the three game formalities. Peter Drury, and this is Jim Beglin. A delight to have him on board. Hi, everyone, and thanks, Peter. It's great to be on board. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Julio says ours, the man. Just keep an eye out for his kicking and general distribution. It's seriously good, and he can get his team on the front foot very quickly through that accurate passing. Yeah, I'd have picked him too. No doubt the fans feel much the same way. Salvio pumps it upfield. Mitroglou puts it back. Who's going to make this theirs? Aim forward. Salvio. 
Gaitan. Where to from here? Played out to the wing. Eliseu. In comes the delivery. Cuts it out. This game is in need of some excitement. It needs help, and it's down to the creative and striking talent to up their game and, and give this crowd something to cheer about. Aimed long and direct. The ball's come loose, and the chase is on. He's got away with one there. I love to see a team closing down from the front like that, and I think they did brilliant to win it back and get the shot away. And it's been taken short. So who's he picking out? Ball swung in. And yeah, that's not going to find its target. Salvio, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Great run this, he's covered quite a distance. Cuts it back. Tony Kroos. Gets it upfield. Did well to step in there, that was more than necessary. Made certain that won't get through. Dodo passes it through. Clearance and very necessary. And it's the whistle for half time. Do it back on the first 45 minutes. I think it's been a very impressive defensive effort. They've never been broken down and contained the opposition. And the second half gets underway. So, deadlock still as the second half begins. Benfica can't seem to retain possession all the way back and they start again. Cristiano Ronaldo. to reflect upon in terms of goals here. It is nil-nil. Spreads it wide. Now it's Salvia. De Bruyne. Looks like a good ball through. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. That's gone a long way up and away. chances to talk off Jim defenses it seems on top here yeah I think it's a scoreline in keeping with what we've seen up to this point combined attempts at goal aren't high in numbers and we could do with something to spark this contest into life oh, the kick has gone ever so well and that's a really instinctive stop too great reflexes to make it happen I thought he showed class there keeper has beaten it away It into the area. The defence can get it clear. This is quite a run, and he's not done yet. Aimed in towards the centre. Now it's Gaita. Tries a through ball. Mitroglou. He's got the ball glued to his feet. Salvio. Final seconds, this has to be it. Goes wide. And Eliseu gets into a good position. It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Well, I think it was a little difficult for him to pick exactly the, the right the option. There. there were so many in the box. I don't think we should be totally surprised that he actually went for the shot in the end. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Whistle's gone, and they've got themselves a free kick.
The final whistle is imminent, but I do think he'll allow time for this free kick. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. A uh, frustrating game for attackers on either side. They hardly had a sniff. Defence is broadly in... Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury, and it's a pleasure to be alongside Jim Beck. Thanks for that, Peter, and may I say a big hello to everyone. He's looking for Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? Oh, that's neat. Cristiano Ronaldo! Marquisio can it clear. So, who's he picking out? He's there to get rid. Mandzukic. That's clear cut. It's a free kick. Not taking him long, and that's going to be a booking. Well, there is concern on the faces of the players standing around him here. Aim forward. Ozali cuts it out. And for a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. So what now? To throw some excellent tackling here and that one a perfect example it is deadlocked this is quite a run and he's not done yet nicely controlled and that's out of reach Poor kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. Looks like a good ball through. Sticks it away! Oh, offside. Well, obviously some sections of the crowd would disagree, but that was the right decision, albeit a late one. Oh, moment's uncertainty there, but it is the right call. Basali. He hits it! Oh, he's really drilled it. He just need to avoid defeat. Well, that's a foul. Three kicks been given. And he's going to have his name taken. Benucci. Quadrado. Now the pass. That's a decent ball. He's been taken out. Could that be a penalty? And the referees decided that he was fouled outside the box, and it is just a free kick. Oh, that is special! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! Unbelievable. First blood drawn! Oh, that is a bit special. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, that lifts some of the pressure, but they need to maintain their work rate. It's been very good up to now. It's a good throw at all, really. He's given away possession cheaply. It's a good-looking cross. They've got it back and could have another go. Oh, it's gone in! Well, listen, the writing was on the wall. It looked like this was going to happen, and it has. 
Well, he was never going to miss from there. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. He ran himself into trouble there. Free kick given away. Bonucci. Dodo. With the ball through. Great ball. Now the shot. He's delivered all right. Oh, that was a close call, but for me, he timed his run to absolute perfection there to stay just onside. And he's still a lot to do, you know, but I think he's tucked that away really well. Listen, it's no surprise to me as to who scored the goal. When you look through this team, he's the standout performer with a, a whole repertoire of different talents. He'll do for me every time. Nicely measured pass. Goes for goal! He scores! And already they're looking to run away with it. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Yeah, tempted and teased the keeper into thinking he could get to it, but it just eased the way to catch the inside of the post. And it's the whistle for half time. And that has been a goal blessed half. It is 3 1. Five minutes from now, we will know who goes through from this group. It's a long forward pass. Popper. Quadrado. Well played, he saw that coming. Looks to slip it through. And he's cut it out. Get that clear. De Bruyne passes it through. Goes to the cross. And he's dealt with that well. Tony Cruz. Surely. And he's straight offside. De Bruyne. A long pass towards the front. It's a loose ball. Now can he finish? Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Sit into the middle. And back out it comes. Loose. Well, that was a really awkward move for the goalkeeper to deal well, with. That's where he wants it. He's made certain that won't get through. Popper. Now it's Mandzukic. The ball's come loose and the chase is on. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Well, there's certainly going to be a card, just a question of colour. Oh, it's red! Some players have clearly taken issue here, and things are threatening to boil over. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Quadrado! Denied by a great piece of goalkeeping. Well, what a tester for the goalkeeper because it was struck with real venom and I thought he dealt with it really well. Oh, he's managed to miss it. Well, at least they're having a right go at it. Finding the net is the most important job on the pitch, but right now, it's also the hardest. And it's Pogba. Quadrado. Pogba. Now it's Mandzukic. Oh, it's hit the post! Thrust towards the front line. Well weighted. 
Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Bonucci. Ups towards the front. Forward it goes. Well positioned to make that interception. It's anyone's ball. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. They are running riot. Surely now, beyond all doubt. He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they've paid the price and deserved to. That is it, the referee has seen enough. So the deal is done. They are through to the knockout stage of the UEFA Champions League. The end of the game. Reflections. shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm Peter Drury and here with me in the commentary box I'm glad to report is Jim Beglin. Glad to be here Peter and I'm ready to rumble. So Jim who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? For me it has to be the magical Angel Di Maria. What I like uh, about him is how he's tailored his game to play in different positions whether it be central midfield attacking midfield or, or as a winger and you know he can adapt to whatever's required i think the opposition defense agree too he's going to be the source of so many of their headaches jordi alba a good play on the left hand side now to profit from it and the balls come loose and the chase is on He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Goes for the cross. Cut out in the nick of time. Marco Verratti did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Maxwell looking for options. And it's Lavezzi. Lavezzi with the ball through. Comes it forwards. Now it's Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah boots it upfield. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Back in once more. And that's been repelled. Saved only by poor finishing. That was a very decent shot from distance, you know, a little less strength and it might have just dipped under the bar. Good effort, though. And a poorly directed kick from the keeper, he's given it away. Tries a through ball. It's in! Mohamed Salah just stayed on the right side of the defender there. I thought he showed wonderful patience, great experience to just make sure he didn't drift offside. And just thought all around it was very intelligent play. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Listen, it's no surprise to me as to who scored the goal. When you look through this team, he's the stand... He scores! And they are disappearing out of sight. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they've paid the price and deserve to. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. David Luiz gets it back. Referee's had a look and he's blown his whistle for half time. 
Massive entertainment and excitement. A two-goal margin, yes, but all things still possible. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Thiago Silva. Daniel Alves. Now it's De Bruyne. Rabiot cuts it out. Thiago Silva. Lovetsi. Matuidi. Who's going to make this theirs? And he's made sure that that won't get through. Thiago Silva. Jordi Alba. Sergio Ramos. Pops it towards the front. Passes it through. Gets into some space. And he's offering an apology for that. He needed to deliver a better ball. He's made certain that won't get through. Either side really getting hold of the ball. Forward it goes. Verratti aimed forward Lovetsi and it's Di Maria Matuidi looks like a good ball through and he's shown him a clean pair of heels oh he's managed to miss it yeah, as long as they don't allow their heads to drop now, they'll be OK. They can still get back into this game with more chances like that. Now it's Ibrahimovic. It's a brilliant interception. And it's Di Maria. Score out to the left, it goes dashing forward at pace. Oh, well intercepted, really alerts the danger. Marco Verratti, and that's it. A decent win via a very competent performance. Without doubt, they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. If you look back on the game, then, Jim. Well, qualification may have been confirmed with a game to spare, but they were determined to end on a high, almost as if they're sending a message to say... After the winter break, the Champions League is back. Stand by for the drama of knockout football. So off we go then. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Well, the very exciting Antoine Griezmann. Uh, he has an impeccable first touch, and with the ball under control, he can use as many skills and and swift changes of direction in, in running from out to win and he wreaks havoc I think the opposition defence agreed too he's going to be the source of so many of their headaches <laughs> if he's given a throw uh, no that's not the ball he wanted De Bruyne is the root one option Looking for options, passing towards the front. 
Liverpool needed to be better there. That's a wasted chance. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. The change to the score, nil-nil it remains. Back to the keeper and go again. Mohamed Salah. Cristiano Ronaldo. Can he find a finish now? It's it into the middle. It's well blocked and back out it comes. De Bruyne. Well, that's where he wants it. And it's Griezmann. Aim forward. Too much on it. That's the keepers. It's a forceful run down the right, but he's short of options now. Mohamed Salah. Mohamed Salah! Ball's loose. Who's getting there? How about it? Whipped in. It's Salah! A decent effort as the first half draws to a close. The midway point of the game. They must restart with the same level of intensity, though. Any drop, and they're going to let this opposition off the hook. They really have to make it count now. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped lots of effort but a, a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone can step up and produce something a little more magical and they continue each to cancel the other out Tony Kroos with the ball through Herrera Carrasco tries the route one option. That's offside. Yes, it is. With some activity down on the touchline, it seems there's going to be a change. Who's going to make this theirs? He's had a look. Nil-nil the score, and we're just about done. A deeply frustrating game. Torres. Jesus Gámez. It's a long forward pass. Mohamed Salah passes it through. it into the area he's dealt with that well Gabby did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger Jesus Gámez he's long and forward Salah plays it in back of the net well, what a signal that is for the opposition. There really isn't much time to get a goal back now. Talking about drama. A oh, lovely header, but really it was all about the delivery. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met, it really was. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Oh, look, it's lovely having a player with such ability in your side. He's always capable of coming up with something important, and he's done it again. Fernando Torres tries to get it forward quickly. Fernandez, Griezmann, decent strike, kept it fizzing low. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. One foot firmly in the next round, victory away from home, home comforts to...
So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beckley. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. It'll be a throw-in. You felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Gabby. Cristiano Ronaldo. Dashing forward at pace. Thrust towards the front line. It's Carrasco. It's got through. They could just about hear the collective sigh there. They know they got away with one. Ferreira Carrasco. Looking up to see who wants it. Shots. And he's been judged offside. No goals as yet. Now it's Torres. Carrasco. It's Carrasco! That is wayward. Right in front of the goal like that, and he's gone and missed it. I won't have to tell him that's not good enough. Tony Kroos tries a through ball and that's been repelled and they've got it back as soon as they gave it away Heading towards half time and it is still scoreless looks like a good ball through and very well to intervene Sides a bit too casual in possession. Ball is over the line. Modric doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Tries the route one option. Torreira Carrasco with the ball through. And the first 45 minutes are up. Well, I think it's been an interesting first half, but they'll be happy to protect their lead. To the scoreline at the break, nil-nil. Here we go again. Tight old game so far. Can that change now? Jimenez. Gabby. the pass promising move that good inroads into enemy territory but no joy De Bruyne is steaming forward All Black deals with it effortlessly and they continue each to cancel the other out that's a throw to base Sergio Ramos Jordi Alba Dodo play for a throw Atletico Madrid look as though they're about to make a change passes it through delivers the ball well blocked and back out it comes and the ball's come loose and the chase is on Ferraro Carrasco 
Demonstrating fabulous determination. He just will not be beaten. Well, we were unlikely to see a goal then because there were so many players crowding out that danger area. I think something very special was going to be needed. De Bruyne shapes the shoots. can get that clear. Well played, he saw that coming. De Bruyne tries to get it forward quickly. Mohamed Salah! And he's found the net! Finally the breakthrough! Oh, the cross was inch perfect and the header unerring. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met, it really was. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. 1-0 as we head towards the end. Looks to slip it through. Van Fran. Tries a through ball. It's there! And that should do it! Within sight of the finish line. I just think he showed a lovely appreciation of where that defensive line formed and he held his run until just the right moment and he broke the offside trap and uh, he took full advantage. That's top marks for me. Who's going to make this theirs? Now the pass. Look forward. What does he try from here? De Bruyne passes it through. The referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. So they bask in their win. A genuinely professional performance and a result which is well deserved. The warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. I'm Peter Drury, and this is Jim Beglin. Hi, Peter. Always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. And we're underway. So, Jim, who do you identify as the key man in this fixture? Well, the passing machine, that is Xavi Alonso. Uh, he can dictate a game from start to finish and do it in a way that makes it look like he's not... Listen, the big names earn their reputations for precisely the reason we've just seen. They have a habit of making their presence felt, and here we are, early stages. He struck one, and he looks hungry for more. That has brought the house down. What a wonderful hit. Well, the technique generates the power in that situation, and once power is assured, any goalkeeper's up against it. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Alonso. De Bruyne. Goes long and forward. Now the pass. Has a hit! He scored inside the first ten minutes to give them a 1-0 lead. First quarter of an hour gone. Chevy Alonso. Javi Martinez. Looks like a good ball through. And the referee's awarded a free kick. Now it's Lewandowski. Xavi Alonso hoists it high. Cuts it out. 
Where to from here? Lam with the ball through. Oh, great ball! And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. Uh, just a little more precision and that longer pass and, and running behind will come off very nicely. The understanding is, is very good, but the execution can't quite match up. Not yet, at least. Throws one in. Bad Stuba gets good distance on it. It's on the back foot. A real chance to break. towards the front line good spell of possession this but very little to show for it Benatia Javi Martinez Mario Gretzsa tries a through ball crunching tackle into that field he brings the first half to a close. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain the momentum now. And leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments and it's 1 0 at the break. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here. We'll see. Mario Kurtzer passes it through. Played out to the right. Dodo. So still just the goal between them. Daniel Alves. Looks to slip it through. Nicely controlled. Mohamed Salah! Too long to get the shot away. Well, look, that's what happens when you've got two minds. You just don't know what you're doing. Vince has got rid of that. Chesney. Thiago Silva. Sergio Ramos. Good idea, just poorly executed. Javi Martinez. Lewandowski De Bruyne Now it's Mohamed Salah Tries a through ball Christian In it goes Two up And threatening to pull clear Oh my goodness That has ripped the rigging Oh, the contact was fantastic. Right on the boot laces and it packed a lot of venom for what was a really potent strike. Dodo. Face to face with his opponent. Boots it upfield. It's Salah! And more and more and more. Surely now, beyond all doubt, a great delivery and a finish to match. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Dodo. The final five minutes. Javi Martinez. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Passes it through. Modric. And 
that will be the final act. So home advantage told, they have the win they wanted and have a useful lead to carry away with them into the second. All of you, wherever you are in the world, from the architectural marvel that is the Fussball Arena, Luncheon. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beckley. Well, I can tell you, I'm truly delighted to join you, Peter, and, and thank you very much for that. Where to from here? Tries a through ball. Benatia gets good distance on it. Chance! This was gone, presumably for offside. And it's Salah. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Mario Goetze tries to get it forward quickly. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Look, if he wants that ball to make it, then he has to pass it with a bit more zip. I think he knew as soon as it left his boot, it was going to be cut out. Just lacked a little more power. Still goalless. Alarm. Javi Martinez, Ribéry, Mario Kurtzer, well played, he saw that coming, oh, he's not going to get that. Dodo. Balls out on the left, now. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Now the pass. Passes it through. Goalkeeper's ball. Lam. Still waiting for the first goal. Javi Martinez. Ribery. He's making a foray down the right. Spoon forward. Munich being made to look sloppy in possession here. Xavi Alonso. Alarm. There's the end of the first half. So off we go once more. No score in the first half. Who's ready to go for it now? And it's Ribéry. Javi Martinez. Chevy Alonso. Dodo. Steered out wide, but he won't reach that one. Take an extended half-time break. You'll be relieved to hear that you have missed nothing. Javi Martinez. Now it's Lewandowski. Love. 
Ibiri. Lam, aimed long and direct. Now it's Ribery. Javi Martinez. Lam. It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. Bayern Munich. Look as though they're about to make a change. Mohamed Salah. It's a loose ball. Hoops it upfield. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Javi Martinez. Thrust towards the front line. Oh, good interception. Xavi Alonso. Lam. Hoops it upfield. Well positioned to make that interception. Who's going to make this theirs? Tony Kroos. Mohamed Salah with the ball through. Salah looking to get on the end of this. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Spoon forward. Modric. And the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Looks to slip it through. So that's it. It is all over. So now do you believe? You have to. Just two more steps to glory. After what we saw in the first game, Jim, what are your observations now? I think the important thing for the second leg was that they did... So we're down to the last four in Europe's Premier Club competition. We are breathing rarefied air. This is almost as big as it gets. So we're up and running. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Alvaro Negredo for me. To start with, we'll be watching a, a very proficient goal scorer all backed up with muscle and power and he's a great foil for a, a quicker partner to link up with and, and feed off yeah I'm inclined to agree the credo looks to thread it through and he's made certain that won't get through Like a good ball through out towards the flank. De Bruyne aimed forward. Coaxed out to the wing. Whipped in. Header! Goal! That is a fine goal, really efficiently done. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Oh, look, it's lovely having a player with such ability in your side. He's always capable of coming up with something important, and he's done it again. goal to give them a 1-0 lead ball has crossed the line and it's a throw
De Bruyne has been caught there, it's a foul. And he must be lenient here, and I doubt he'll get too many more chances. So, another set play. Robertson cross. For Gulli. Perejo looking for options. Tries a through ball. Played out wide. Up for a header! Oh, brilliant from the Grado! Valencia are back in business! What a super header, dispatched beautifully. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. That has certainly made things interesting. Well, in a tight game like this, there was always going to be little to separate them, but he really made that count. He scored! And they get themselves in front! A great delivery and a finish to match. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Listen, it's no surprise to me as to who scored the goal. When you look through this team, he's the standout performer with a, a whole repertoire of different talents. He'll do for me every time. There is the half-time whistle. Somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's got route one option. He's ha he scores. Oh, that's not going to count. And we go again. Well, obviously, some sections of the crowd would disagree, but that was the right decision, albeit a late one. Moments uncertainty there, but it is the right call. Enzo Perez. Tries to stroke it through. Looking to force his way through. And it's for Gulli. Into the channel. Looks to slip it through. Parejo. Negredo. Towards the front. It's Salah! A chance here! No mistake! And surely that does it! Perfect time! Decisive strike! Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Our players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great poaching positions. How quick-minded was that? And he's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Mustafi. out on the left now and the finish well he would surely have scored there more times than not that's an untidy challenge free kick given And there goes the final whistle. One foot firmly in the next round. Victory away from home. Home comforts to come. Much of the job is done. And after all of that, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, when you can go away from home...
second leg of this penultimate stage of the UEFA Champions League. They are on the cusp for the winners, the final. And that gets things running. Dodo. Modric. Forwards. It's in! De Bruyne versus the keeper, and only one winner. Well, when you go one on one with the keeper, you can't afford any indecision, and that was decisive and clinical. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. And scored inside the first 10 minutes to make it 1 0. Javi Fuego, Modric, Daniel Alves, De Bruyne, now the pass. Well positioned to make that interception, Marcelo, Dodo, Modric, so what now? Enzo Perez. Salah. Spoon forward. And it's Faguli. Now it's Negredo. Dodo. Very well to intervene. Salah looks to slip it through. Good effort, and it is right on half time. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to groom with the lead at half time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Leading 1 0 at the break. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Dodo. And it's De Bruyne. Looks to dink one in. Back of the net! Two to the good! They have breathing space! Oh, great control, as if it was tied to his feet. Negredo. Cristiano Ronaldo. And it's De Bruyne. Mohamed Salah! They are running riot! And surely that settles it! Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Mohamed Salah is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. Played out to the wing. Good clearance and very necessary. Modric. Cristiano Ronaldo. And a play for a goal kick. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Almost nothing left on the clock here. They have one foot in the final. Diego deals with it effortlessly. Fine defending there. That's a bit of penetration to go with all this possession. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. So the final now awaits, delirium in the stands. The fans know that they will get their big day. And after all of that, Jim...
of all the grand stadia in world football, none more impressive than this. A very warm welcome to all of you from the San Siro in Milan. This evening, we bear witness to the greatest fixture in European club football. A time for grandeur, glamour, glory. It is the Champions League final. And so the distinctive sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem. Now, Keylor Navas, keeps goal, Pepe, Ramos, Danilo, Marcelo, Kovacic, Tony Kroos, Modric, Bale, Cristiano Ronaldo. Sensational start! Absolutely thundered in, keeper, no chance. Is it just me, or did he make that look very, very easy? That was terrific skill and composure from him. He finished with such a plum. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Listen, the pressure and intensity of a final can give the scores of that first goal a huge, huge lift. The others, well, they'll get to feel a sense of panic now. Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Where to from here? It's a promising run he's making on the right. Benzema. Just about here, the collective sigh there. They know they got away with one. Oh, that's neat. Has a swing at it! Just off target. Well, with this guy and the talent he's got, you know he's probably going to try his look from there, but that one he didn't really get right at all. Poorly directed kick from the keeper. He's given it away. It's come loose. Looks like a good ball through. And the whistle's gone, presumably for offside. And that was just fractionally offside. Pepe scored inside the first ten minutes to make it 1-0. Tries to dink it in. Now here's the through ball. Real Madrid get it back again. Cristiano Ronaldo with the ball through. It's Salah. Cristiano Ronaldo! He scored! Unbelievable. Two up and threatening to pull clear. Keylor Navas reacted well to the initial effort but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Look, that's one of the first things you learn, whether you're a striker or not. Just anticipate a goalkeeping parry or spillage, and sometimes you'll get lucky, it'll come your way. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Crunching tackle. Hits it! Well, that was a really awkward one for the goalkeeper to deal with. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. The shot's on! And he's straight offside. Pepe. 
Tony Cruz. Danilo doing well down the right, but he's left himself in need of support. De Bruyne. Whistle's gone, and we've reached the halfway point of the final. So we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you? At this stage, but will their approach be the same after the break? Um, certainly, if they don't add to it early on in the second half, I think they may begin to retreat, just try and hold on to what they've got. It has been a remarkable contest, decorated by goals, and two between them at half-time. Aim forward. Now the pass. Whistle goes. He's been given offside. Tries a through ball. Bale. Bale has got himself a free kick. Oh, that's a booking. Always looked it. He does seem to be in considerable discomfort. Do hope it's nothing serious. De Bruyne already, of course, on the score sheet. Out to the left it goes. Turns and goes back. And De Bruyne! Surely that settles it. Oh, my goodness, that has ripped the rigging. Well, the technique generates the power in that situation, and once power is assured, any goalkeeper's up against it. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Modric. De Bruyne could complete a hat-trick here, Jim. What do you reckon? Well, I think he's got every chance, and he's got plenty of time, too, to get his third. And the way he's gone about this match, he looks very much like uh, he could even end up getting more. He's full of hunger and running. Timbers on the back foot. Mohamed Salah plays the route one option. And the flag has stayed down. Timely intervention. Cristiano Ronaldo makes himself available. Benzema. It's a loose ball. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Mohamed Salah. Passes it through. Kovacic. Takes it out to the wing. Cristiano Ronaldo. The ball's come loose and the chase is on. Pops it upfield. Danilo. Tries to get it forward quickly. Thiago Silva. It's long and forward. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. And it's Benzema. Looks to slip it through. Modric! It's a goal! What about that, Jim Beglin? It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. So is this the start of a comeback? It will be the final act. The date in their history, the pinnacle of their existence, the greatest honour European football has to bestow, winners of the Champions League. So on to centre stage come the central characters, the individuals who, as a team, blended into champions, and this is their moment.